Mary ladies. I'm back with uh, some cards I made at uh, my first Copic class. Um, so I didn't design these. Um, the owner of the store did, uh, Laura. But um, I colored them and she taught us uh, different techniques for beginners. Um, I mean, I've taught myself, but I still learned some things. Um, this first one here is really cute. So she helped me color this green in on this side and she asked me to kind of match it so I think I did a pretty good job of matching both sides. Um, I really like that we worked with black, the dark um, the grays again because I'm starting to I think get the hang of blending the grays. Um, so I didn't have time to assemble it at the class so I just had time to color. So I colored both images and then assembled it when I got home. Um, but she supplied all the materials and the markers to color. Um, for this this one here, um, she gave us kind of a outline and cheat sheet type thing. It's Dane Dapper from High Hope Stamps. So that's this one here. And the paper, pattern paper is basic gray. Nordic holiday sweater sweater weather is what this paper is here. It's double sided. Um, and the inside is that stamp here, same paper for the background. Um, so I really like how that turned out. Um, and she gave us some ribbon to to work with, so that's what I did. So I did that, and then we made this card here, I really like how my grays are turning out. Um, she had glittered this up, I just haven't had time to do that, so I can go back and do that later. Um, this is the first time I've worked with three colors for the skin tone, so I think it actually turned out pretty good. I meant to buy the third color and I didn't. So that's how that one turned out, and then that's the inside. Uh, this paper, I think it's, yeah, it's basic gray Nordic holiday again. So that's that one. Really cute image. Oh, and the image is, what's this one? Uh, Holy Jolly Santa from High Hopes. So that's a High Hopes stamp too, which I believe High Hopes is a, it's a Canadian company. So I'm starting to really like that company now. Now that I found them. So those are the cards I made at the at the class. And then I had to buy a couple things, so couldn't go to the class and not buy anything. So this is another high hope stamp. Another penguin one. I think they're so cute. So they come like this, so you have to mount them yourself. But it's really not that hard. And this one's called Frozen Fun. A little penguin with snowballs. So I got that. And then I got Memento Northern Pine Ink. It's a really nice green. So I got that. And I got the Summer Sky Memento Ink. I only had the black one, so I thought I'd start maybe getting some of the colors. So I liked those. And then I picked up some embossing folders. So I picked up this one here, and I've never heard of this company before, but it's bringing crafts to you. Um, it's the pine tree scene. So I got that. And I got this one here, which says let it snow. And then uh, that's what it's called, let it snow. So I got that embossing folder. And then I picked up three new Copic markers for, I'm going to try using some, doing blonde hair. So she recommended these colors, so I did Y23, Mom. Y21, hold on Matthew, and YR23. So I haven't used them yet, but I'll try some coloring blonde hair and see how that turns out. And one last thing, I picked up this Bow Bunny. Love Letters collection. Um, 
I'm not sure if this is an old collection or a new one, but I thought it was really pretty paper. Yep, paper there. So if someone could let me know, I'm not sure if this is an old one or a new one. Okay, well that's my little haul and my card share. Um, I hope you like them and they weren't my creations, but uh, I did assemble them and color them. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.